Hey guys, welcome back to the homestead. And today I'm gonna to be changing my oil in my 2021 Cub Cadet Challenger. It's a 750 EPS. EPS just stands for electronic power steering. And uh, so let me, I'm just gonna take you along. There's not a lot of information on it. And even the Cub Cadet dealer had a problem finding the filter. Well, not a problem, but it took them like a few minutes, you know? So I'll put a link in the description for the filter and all the information on that. So uh, this will just be a quick video, so let's get started. Well, what you'll need is you will need a 19 millimeter socket, that's for your uh, oil plug to drain your oil. You'll need a filter, and like I said, I'll put that in the description, what it is. You'll also need one of this, one of these, you'll see why. You could probably get it off with, you know, oil uh, filter pliers but you'll see in a minute why. <laughs> and then you'll need, you'll have to get three quarts because it takes like 2.1 quart. Uh, and I put 10W40, depending on where you live, we get really cold. We don't get super hot temperatures here, but you know, we can get in the 80 to 90 range sometimes, so. So to access the filter in here and to put the oil in, you have to take off the seat, which is very easy. You just lift up on it and pull it up and it comes right off. It's pretty easy. Then you have this cover here. Here's a handle and you just pull up on that. Get that out of the way. Okay, once you get the cover off here, if you can see your filter is right here and it's not very easy accessible. I'll try to zoom in there a little bit so you can see it. And then right, if you can see right here, kind of pointing to it, is how you check your oil and where you put your oil in. So we'll take that filter out, but I'm gonna show you underneath here real quick. Okay, I'll put a flashlight on there so you can see, but this is your oil drain plug. Like I said, it's 19 millimeter, and you access, it's easier to access to come in from the passenger side underneath. Okay, we'll take our 19 millimeter wrench, and I don't know how good a video I'm gonna get because I don't have it propping the camera up kind of um, so you can see it. So we'll break it loose. So I kind of want to show you what this uh, plug looks like. There's kind of a spring that comes out of it. So just so you know, try to hold this, but when it comes in, you want to set it right in there. And then there's a little cup in there, if you can see, strainer kind of cup that sits in there. So that's just exactly how it goes back up in. All right, I put the socket on the oil filter and uh, I have a ratchet and what seems to work best here, let me show you this. I put two three inch extensions together and it's like the perfect length. <laughs> so you can get it in there and um, put it on in there and break it loose. And it, you could probably do this with pliers, but it's just very hard to get anything in here because it's such in a compacted place where you can hardly get to it so this seems to work pretty good bust it loose and uh, comes out of here pretty pretty easy with the socket all right we'll take our new filter and rub a little oil around the our gasket there and uh, s screw this on real quick Okay, what you're gonna need is kind of a longer funnel, uh, like this, if you can see. And you're gonna pour your oil about this speed right there, if you can see that, let me turn it a little bit. You don't wanna pour it, because it will come out the bottom as it goes in. So you wanna kinda of like give it a medium stream, I guess you'd say. All right, we'll put our dipstick back in and we're gonna run it for a minute. Oh, 
Okay, we let it run for good over five minutes. We'll give it a good check here, see where we're at. So we are nice and full. guys we are done everything's good we're ready to go pretty simple oil change so that's how you do it uh, and um, like I said you're gonna want to get one of those sockets for the filters because uh, it's a pain if you don't have that but other than that pretty simple so just remember socket for filter and 19 millimeter socket for your uh, oil pan plug and you will be able to get it done like I said I'll put all the uh, the filter information in the description below. So thanks for watching. God bless y'all.